Just give me John 424. Give me John 424. Before you leave, 
So now in America, now in America, Obama just passed a law for Obamacare. It's a health care program that everybody in America, not in America, but the whole world, is going to have to take the RFID check. A comment knows about this, that's why she went to the, uh, India a couple months ago to find out about the biometric system. All your Trinidadians are going to have to take this RFID check. That's going to be a new TC dollar. We're going to spike your hand when you go to Harney, Vizitel, or anywhere to buy food or anything. And that's indicated in the Bible too. So Obama passed it one time. By March 2013, everybody can have to take an RFID check. Huh? You're going to put it in your right hand or your forehead. I just got your hand. I just got your hand. Revelation uh -huh. 13 verse 16. Yeah, go ahead. And he caused that all both small, red, red, uh -huh. Uh -huh. free, and born uh -huh. to receive a mark so, in their right hold, hand. Hold on. That mark, when you look up that word mark, when you look up that word mark in a Greek it's called parasma. That means to insert, to prick, to stick into. So that's what they're gonna do. They got a club in, uh, in Spain called the Baja Club, where all the celebrities go to. For you to go in that club, you want to take the RFID chip. And in America right now, any newborn baby that's coming up in America, they're giving these babies these RFID chips. They'll track you wherever you go. If you make love to your man, whatever you do, they're going to know. If you, have, uh, if you have cancer or diabetes, high blood pressure, they're going to know through this chip. It's, it's connected to the satellite dish. Okay, did you saw the movie Enemy of State? Yeah, you saw the movie Enemy of State with Will Smith? He couldn't run, they were tracking him down? That's an old movie, bro. Yeah, but that's a good movie to watch. Now, what does it mean, bro? To receive a mark in their right hand or in their forehead. Uh-huh. Go ahead. And that no man might buy or sell. Mm -hmm. Take me that has the mark. That's right, don't buy himself. So, for you to buy a food or buy a movie, you're going to have to take the hard find each other. Now, hold up on that. If you take this RFID chip, this is what's going to happen. You remember Revelation 14? I think it's first time, brother. And then, Revelation 14, verse 10. Yeah, go ahead. And the third agent follows uh -huh. them, saying with a loud voice, If any man worship the beast and his image. So, if any man worship the beast and his image, go ahead. Go ahead. And receive his mark in his forehead uh -huh. or in his hand, uh -huh. the same shall drink of the wine of the wrath of the most high, uh -huh. which is poured out with those mixtures into the cup of his indignation. So in other words, the most high will destroy you if you take the dark by beach. Because when you take the dark by beach, give me that book in the same ship, Roger, about you give your life to Satan. All right. Okay. Hold us, hold us for a minute. Got it? So when you think about this kind of book, this is a book called uh, The World Lies Dictator. It's about the author of Dwight L. Kinman. Okay, he said if you take the chip. Anyway, that chip is consists of your, 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 your name, your picture, your ID number, your fingerprint, your physical description, your address, your history, your occupation, your tax information, your criminal record, and also it's going to take a picture of your regular scan. They show you the movie of Minority Report. They show the book of a gym. Wait, a bit more. Yeah, and that one too. And they show you in Total Recall also. Total Recall. All right, your eye scan is going to be on this um, RFID chip. But let me get straight to the point. So, I hear you. All right, it said, um, uh, what does it mean? Let me get straight to the point. Um, it said, um, all right, here is the inspired um, scripture. The Black Holy Spirit is warning us that all who take the mark in the last days will be sealed to Satan forever. So when you take this RFID chip, you're giving your life to Satan. So whatever you do, don't take this RFID chip. Okay? Yeah, right. And give me Revelation 16 verse 1. I'm Scotty. Give me that real quick. Revelation 16 verse 1. And right. I heard a great voice uh -huh. out of the temple saying to right. the seven angels, Go, ahead. Go your ways and pour out the vials of the wrath of God upon the earth. Go ahead. And the first went 
and pour out his fire uh -huh. upon the earth. But, and they fell in Nordstrom and Previous saw upon the men which had the mark of the beast. Which had the what? The mark of the beast. Yeah, grease them. Uh, you say grease them noise? Yeah. yeah. Who had the what? The mark of the beast. You will be destroyed if you take this RFID chip. Okay? Right now, Obama is uh, telling Obama is telling the family if you want uh, if you want welfare, if you want uh, unemployment check, if you want your pension, you gotta take the RFID chip. Food stamp. Oh, uh, food stamp. Yeah, the chip and bacon. Yeah, and and I'm in England and London. And that's a fact. Yeah. Okay. All right. And this come here, and this is your pastor supposed to be warning you about. For the I hear you. Give, give me Jeremiah 3 verse 15. Give me Jeremiah 3 verse 15. And give me Hosea 12 verse 10. I'm going to show you who the real pastors are. And guess what? You're looking at them. Okay? Give me that real quick. Jeremiah 3 verse 15. Give me Hosea 12 verse 10. Jeremiah 3 verse 15. Yeah, read, bro. He said, And I will give you pastors uh -huh. and put it to my heart. To my heart. Okay? Not trying to get your money. Because we we're not concerned about your money. We're concerned about your well being, your, your soul. Wake up. For you to wake up. Okay? Go ahead. We shall feed you with knowledge uh -huh. and understanding. So this short period of time, you got to know knowledge for this short little period of time. That's more than you will learn to, in your two hours or three hours of church. It's say praying hallelujah, praise Jesus. Yeah. Now, put your money in the collection plate. Yeah. All right? Now, give me Jose 12 verse 6. Give me Hosea 12 verse 10. And you notice how I'm speaking to you. I'm speaking out of the word of God. You probably heard the most shook uh, <laughs> Give me, give me Hosea 12 verse 10. Alright, give me Hosea 3 verse 7. Yeah. Hosea 12 verse 7. Hosea 12 verse 7. Alright. Let's leave it alone. Hosea 12 verse 7. I have yeah. also yeah. spoken by yeah. prophet. So the most I said, he speaks by. Then not to be God too, bro. So the most I what? I have also spoken by the prophet. Yeah, so the most I ain't gonna leave his throne and go ahead and speak to you directly. He, so he, work, he works for his prophet. That's out here in the street. Go ahead, brother. And I have voice by the son. Uh huh. You. The Timothy by. By the ministry of the prophet. That's right. So that's how the Most High works. He had warning the people that great evil was about to come on his island. Great evil was coming. Right, go ahead. Go ahead. He said Jeremiah 28, go ahead. Eight, go ahead. the prophet, and it might happen this year. Go ahead. The prophet that have been before me uh -huh. and before thee uh -huh. of all prophesied against many countries. Yeah, many countries. Go ahead. Against great kingdom. Against great kingdom. Of war. Of war. World War III is about to happen. Mm -hmm. Alright, Obama just initiated that he's going to uh, start World War III in November when he gets elected. That's one of the last prophecies. Right. So 2012 might be the last uh, year yeah. of 2013. Right. Right. So I hope we just tell, tell our people, wake up, wake up. The kingdom of heaven is at hand. It's time for you to repent and turn away, uh, turn away from your wicked way. That's right. And follow the Lord. Mm -hmm. uh, go ahead. And of evil. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Yeah, this is evil right here. When, when, when Obama said, in, uh, in his Obamacare page 101, he said you got to take the RFID chip, and the whole world got to take this. Hey, that's, that's wickedness, man. That's wickedness. That's yeah, it has cyanide. So if you disobey the new world order, Obama could put, uh, press a button and just kill you one time because he got cyanide poison in it. You see, it's any mission impossible, the latest mission impossible. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, no, the latest born identity. Yeah. When you see the Chinese girl and the Negro guy, you sort of push out of the I'm going to lead to the side and black on the back of my nose.